I learned long ago that how you start your day determines if you will ever succeed or not. Most young people do not know this, but the easiest way to tell if a man will ever succeed or if he will fail is by studying how he uses his morning. I may not know the specific actions each successful person starts their day with, but since I have read books, listened to the audio, and have observed successful people and practiced a few of their habits, I can correctly say how successful people start their day. The reason for uncovering this truth about starting your day is simple. How you start your day can determine to a considerable extent how your day will go. When you take charge of your day early, you can be sure that the rest of the day will go well. But when you do not take charge of your day early, but misuse your mornings, you can be certain that the rest of the day would be a mess. There is nothing out of the box about it. It's just the way things are. 1. Successful people start their day focused on themselves. When I used to write daily email copies, I write a tip from a prominent email copywriter, Ben Settle, that the first hour of each new day should be for you. I didn't understand how impactful this would be until I started to practice it. You see, it will sound selfish because I said successful people start their day focused on themselves. But because we are often at our best when we wake up in the morning, it would be foolish to use that morning to serve someone else's purpose. Successful people realize that the mornings belong to them and they use it to achieve some of their best goals for a long time. Author John Grisham woke up each morning by 4 a.m. to write before preparing for work. Also, author Jeff Goins and a host of others do the same thing. For a long time, I have found out that if you don't complete some of your best goals or work before 10 a.m., you may never be able to seize the day anymore. If you want the best out of your life, Focus the first few hours of your morning on yourself. Do what would help you achieve your best goals. This is one of the ways I am sure successful people start their day. 2. Successful people start their day with a clear goal. A goal, as they say, is a dream with a deadline. Almost every night before I start the next day, I already know what I would be doing the following day. I don't want to wake up floundering or confused about what I will achieve for that day. This is how you differentiate people who will succeed from people who will never smell success. Successful people have a clearly defined plan of what they intend to achieve for each day, while those who fail usually don't. Successful people can tell you what they will be doing by a particular time of the day. They have planned out each hour of the day. Things may not work out as perfectly as they planned, but this plan will at least help them guide their day. So it is never wasted on frivolities. If you don't have a plan for each day, you're not planning to succeed. Each day of your life may not be loaded with work, but part of being serious about pursuing your dream of achieving your life's vision defines what your day should look like. Those who fail to plan, of course, are planning to fail. I may not utterly achieve most of the goals and plans I have set out for each day, but I can always tell you from the top of my head what I will be doing for each day and at what time I will engage in each activity. This is another good way to seize your day if you intend to succeed. 3. Successful people start their day positive. Let me tell you something. When you wake up tomorrow morning, start your day feeling gloomy and acting gloomy. Get up lazily from the bed and grumble for a few minutes about how things aren't working or how some things aren't well arranged in your apartment. I can bet you that if you start your day that way, you will undoubtedly live through that day that way. How you start your day determines how you live through your day and almost certainly how you end your day. When you start your day negatively, of course, it affects your emotions. As your emotions tend to go further and further in the direction you lead it, you become weaker and less energetic and unenthusiastic, requiring more effort to even carry out all the tasks you're supposed to effectively. In fact, it crushes your creativity because you send a wrong signal to your brain with such negativity. That morning, negativity kills your brain power. However, start your day feeling positive and acting positively. Don't worry about what happened the day before. Instead, hit the floor with a smile on your face and positive outlook and everything. You can be sure that if you carry on that attitude into the kitchen, into the bathroom, while you're preparing for work, when you're driving to work, when you sit down to start working, you will almost certainly carry it through your day. And the good side is how positive you are will show in your work efficiency. If you want to be more efficient, effective and creative, let your brain experience a positive vibe and learn to stay positive against all the odds. I may not be specific about the activities successful people start their day with, but I'm certain successful people start their day focused on themselves first. 
doing within the first few hours of their day those things that drive them towards their goals. And also, they start their day clearly planned. Successful people never enter into their day hoping things would just pan out. They set goals, make definite plans, apportion times to each plan and work with it. They carry out a to-do list that they dutifully follow. And finally, successful people start their day positive. A positive outlook in the morning can significantly impact the rest of your day. What do you think? How else do you think successful people start their day? Share with us in the comments. And if this video inspired you, like the video.